What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com. And in the last Dynasty video, we went through our Season 4 preseason. We done some recruiting. We set up our schedule. Uh, got some red shirt stuff out of the way. And today, we're going to play our first game of the season. And that is against Arkansas. This was the team that we replaced in the SEC. And I thought it'd be a fun little side story to uh, play this team. Now, it's been a while since I played Arkansas, but I'm pretty sure... They run a pro-style offense that's more or less meant to run the ball a little bit more than usual. It'll come down to who their talent is. You know, if they got really good receivers and a quarterback, they'll probably throw more. But I think they like the run in general, and I'm pretty sure they run a 4-3 defense. Now, it looks like we got more talent than they do, but the rest of that, we just won't know until we head into the game. But before we do that, we need to look at recruiting. We are going after five guys. I stretched it to five. Normally, I like to go after four or less. But we're going after the, arguably the best strong safety in the country. Going after a really good quarterback. We don't need a quarterback, but it's very hard to come across a quarterback with that good of an arm. And my offense, you know, I've kind of gone back and forth on a couple different things. I don't need a dual threat quarterback to do what I got to do. And I'll gladly take this guy's arm in a heartbeat. And he'll be a good one to red shirt and uh, get him going here in a couple of years. Then we got a really good free safety. As you know, our secondary, we've been trying to recruit that hard. For the last couple of seasons, it's been a bit of a challenge finding quality talent. Hopefully, these two guys right here, if we can nail them down, then that should boost up the secondary some, you would think. Uh, then we're looking at a wide receiver. We're needing some depth here. A local kid, Shamari Hemingway, 64208. He kind of fits everything that I, I really like. He can play outside, inside. More likely, he'll be an outside receiver, but I would love to have him. And then, last but not least, we're going after a defensive tackle. We need help here in the worst way. We need a lot of bodies, and we're going to go after this guy pretty hard. So, But nothing has changed since the last video. You're not missing out anything there. I just wanted to point out the five main guys that we are going after. There's nothing to look at Sports Illustrated because nothing happened in week one, as you can see here. There were a handful of games, but only uh, two top 25 teams played. Louisville destroyed Alabama AM, and and then Colorado beat Oregon State. That's why I didn't really mention too much about that. Uh, we can go over and look at my playbook. I've changed a couple of things. Now, as a whole, the offense is going to stay pretty much the same. But I've changed a couple of formations. First of all, I got rid of Gun Bunch. One of the I'm going to use a, a couple of house rules, at least for this dynasty or for this season going forward. We'll just see what happens. But one of the rules is I'm not going to use any plays where I roll out unless the play calls for. For example, you're not going to see me roll out and try to manipulate the safeties and such like you see me do with gun bunch deep cross up or gun trips uh, deep cross. I'm not going to do that because those plays aren't technically designed for that. So I'm not going to do that. But when I come across, you know, I formation twins, PA rollout or PA boot, that tells that forces me to want to roll out and such. So that's what I'm going to do there. Plus, I want to use another house rule where I'm just not going to use hardly any motion at all. But one of the things I wanted to do was take out Gun Bunch, because that's all I was using it for, was the, that rollout play. I'm going to put in Gun Wide Trips. It's been a long time since I've used this play or formation. It's got some good things in there. I got rid of Gun Trips, and I substituted for Gun 5 Wide. I wanted more diversity personnel-wise in the playbook. So occasionally, I may just go on a run and go in 5 Wide right down the field. We'll just see how that goes. The rest of this stay pretty much the same. All right, uh, I think I am ready. There's nothing else to really look at. Now, we can look at the team info screens, but there's nothing to see there because neither team has played yet. So let's just go ahead into the game. See if I can speed this up a little bit. And then, really excited to get the season going. It should be a whole lot of fun. And now, we are at home. I want to check out their uniforms. Do they have any alternate options? That is their default. It's the first time I played Arkansas in, gosh, a long time. They got an alternate two. That's their black, then, which is interesting. I don't know if that's meant to be their away uniform. Usually the alternate one is the home uniform. Either way, we're not going to use that. We're going to, I guess, go with the default away. All right, let's head into the game. Should be a lot of fun. Going to try out a couple different things. Again, like I mentioned, I'm not going to create my own rollout plays per se. I'm going to use the ones that are in there by default and then... I'm going to limit my motion. I'll talk about that throughout the season. Normally, I, I use motion to manipulate the defense some. I'm going to back out of that and try to rely more on pure execution 
in some areas. So that'll be a little bit of a challenge, but I want to try that out for myself. All right. Guess what? I mean, we've been in this same stadium for the last six straight games, it seems. National championship game, conference championship game, our last home game at uh, in the regular season was at home, and now we're back here again, hosting the Arkansas Razorbacks. We got a packed house. It should be a sold-out crowd for the remainder of the dynasty. And here come the Tulane Green Wave, your reigning national champions. And I just can't believe I'm actually saying that. Really good looking uniforms from Arkansas, nice and clean. Who are they going to highlight? Thomas, this is the transfer that we moved down the defensive end. He was a linebacker. I think he's going to wreak havoc on some teams. I really hope he does. He looks like to be a complete stud, just a good pickup for us. And they're going to pick us to win as expected. Let's go to the coin toss. Arkansas will win it, and they will kick it. So we're going to get the ball first. The first thing we got to do at the beginning of every season is you want to go into formation subs. That way, these formation subs stick. If you do it outside of a game, they won't stick once you get back in it. So that's what I'm going to start off first. The first thing I want to do is... I want to reset everything. Let me just go to reset subs. I'm going to reset all. I'm okay with all of that. Uh, all of our wide receivers are about the same speed, so I'm not worried about who gets what, like in slot and whatnot. Um, I want to have all that set. The biggest thing I want to look at is halfback. I want to make sure Williams gets about, I don't know, five or at least six of the formations. I want him in this formation here. There he is right there. Everything else should stay the same. Here, I may put Hardesty there. Everything else looks good. Here, I'm going to put Williams there. Here, we are going to leave that as is. I like Hardesty and Williams there. Uh, I think, yes, that's fine. Here, we are going to put in the little engine that could. We're going to put in a little Anthony Gibbs. That's just one spot there. Uh, do I run a lot of... Uh, yes, yeah, so I'm going to keep Williams there. I may put uh, to Cray here. I'm going to put Williams there. Sorry, Decray is just not going to get the ball a whole lot. We're three deep at halfback unless somebody gets hurt. Hopefully that doesn't happen. And at the gun five wide, I am going to use a sub. I'm going to use the tight end sub package. We got two pretty good tight ends. Both of them are pretty fast. One of them is really good in Robert Wright. But I'm going to use the tight end sub package here. And the only other sub package I'm going to use, I may not even put right in here. We got four pretty decent wide receivers. We'll just see how that goes. But in terms of the rest of this, I like where everything's at. I just want to make sure Williams is where he's at without me having to manually take him out over and over again. Because I want to make sure the other two running backs get uh, the ball a little bit throughout the game. So that is it on offense. Now let's go to defense. I want to make sure this is correct. My nickel. I want my best outside linebacker stamper there, which is good. And there's my middle linebacker. Yes. All that looks good there. Next thing I want to do is go to punt block. I want to make sure my two fastest guys are here. I'm going to put Amos on one end and we're going to put Inky Johnson on the other. I want two of my fastest guys on the outside if possible. That way, Gibbons does his thing. Yes, I, that's kind of what I want there. Field goal block, I don't have to worry about any of that. So I think I'm done with the formation subs. Audibles, I still got, I don't do enough of the manual audibles. I've been getting more into the quick audible stuff. Seems to be just a little bit easier, but in time, I may dabble with this. Uh, but I don't think I'll have to fool with it too much. Having said all that, now let's look at Arkansas. See what we're dealing with. Starting quarterback, just a 72 speed, which is good. That means I can go after him some. 85 overall. He's not an impact guy. Can you throw it at all? 86 accuracy is not bad. 94 power is really good. He may be chucking a deep sum today. Impact halfback, Felix Jones. If anybody remembers him back in the day, him and, uh, oh, uh, number five, Darren McFadden. They were just an awesome combo back in the day. But Felix Jones played for the Cowboys for quite a bit. Had a decent little career and whatnot. But he's an impact guy. We got to deal with him today. This tells me they're probably going to run the ball quite a bit. Backups look okay. True sophomore Keon Wallace. Fullback, 85 and 80. Not bad. Wide receiver, 82. And then it's a drop-off. 74, 68. Just, just awful. Absolutely dreadful. What about a tight end? They don't have anything at tight end. So the entire offense is going to go through that guy right there. So we're just going to play a ton of man, more than likely, and just try to keep everything in front of us. 
Let's look at their offensive line. 78, 76, 70, 78, and 87. Okay for now the Conference USA, I guess. But they got one really good offensive tackle, and that's that guy right there. So our transfer and Thomas is going to get challenged against this guy. They run a 4-3. They got 82, 82, 82 at the end. This guy's really small. I mean, he's lightweight. He's tall. But only 202 pounds. He's practically a wide receiver. Uh, 72 on the other end. Uh, let's see. Defensive tackle, 91. Really good. Then a bit of a drop off, 78, 76. 76, 80, and 84 at the linebackers. One of them being an impact guy. We'd love to have him. Corner, 82, 80, 76. So nothing killer there. I can see a bit of a matchup nightmare for them. Uh, free safety, 85, but 85 speed. So he's not super fast. 82 behind him. 84 strong safety. So they're pretty solid across the board. Uh, they got an awful kicker and an awful punter. All right. Let's get this show on the road. Hopefully it won't take me too long to adjust to a couple of things I'm doing on offense, especially new cool formations I'm going to use. Let's see if Batiste can start off with a good return. Not much. Get it out to the 20. Uh, I think what I'm going to do, let me go over here, make my one adjustment tight end slot there. And we'll probably do the tight end slot here as well. And we can go ahead and start off here. Let's go halfback screen. Today we get to watch We're going zone dive. We're going to bounce this over to our reigning Heisman winner. Really have to their game plan. Just do something like that. Just try to do a stiff arm. Get a first down. I think he got it. Nice. Good for him. Now, one thing I probably need to do is do that as a quick audible. And next, look at just do basic speed option. How about that? They are going nickel man. Who is on who? I, again, I'm not going to do hardly any motions. I'm just going to leave it as is. Good defense. Nowhere really to go. I probably should have went to the other side. We are on the right hash, second and nine. Uh, let's go try Y stick. They're going man. We'll go to somebody on the outside. Let's see what these safeties do. Uh, going cover zero. Let's see if Batiste can make it. I'm going to let him do it. Overshot it. Overshot the throw, so it's third and nine. Let's go and try halfback corner. They're going man. I'm going to try to go to Cooper for a first down. They're going cover zero. I'm going to play this safe, though. We're going to just get the first down there. I probably should have went over the top, but that's okay. First and ten. Good deal. So let's go and keep this simple. Let's run basic slam for now. Zone 4-3. Let's go back to Williams. I am going to go to the right, get away from that impact guy. Good play here, get a first down. Uh, we can stay here, or we can run basic option. Zone 4-3. Probably end up going back to the right again. Going to have to pitch that one off quick. Good defense. Somebody came through the line. Uh, second and 13. Uh, let's go here. Let's go RB deep. We're going zone. Might not get a lot of yards here. We'll see what happens. Terrible throw. Wow, that was awful. So now it's, what, third and forever again. Third and 13. I, I'm going to go half back direct, and we're going to probably have a more feasible fourth down. Let's see if this will work or not. See if we can get a first down with Williams. I wanted a more manageable fourth down, but it looks like we got the first anyway. So we're going to, let's go, uh, let's go gun normal. Let's do a dive with Williams. We're going zone 4-3. I'm just going to try to go up to gut here. Good play. Great play. Almost got a first down. Nice play there. Second and inches. Uh, let's go back halfback screen. We're going zone, so I guess we'll go back to Williams. At least our best player is getting the ball quite a bit out of the gate. Get a throw. I'm just going to do a stiff arm. Let's give him a bit of a break. Let's go to Montario Hardesty. Let's go ace normal for a little bit, and let's see how he handles things. Let's go halfback slam. Man 4-3. I will probably again go back to the right. 
get a few yards, not a whole lot. A couple, maybe three yards on that. Uh, what I may do, I got some new plays here. I'm on the 21. Do I got room for it? We're about to find out. Okay, they're going man, so we'll probably just go to Cooper on this one. I don't think we... Yeah, they're, even, they're double teaming Batiste. So we're going to go to Cooper. Off the back foot. That was a bad throw. That was my fault, I think. But we got the touchdown. So six points out of the gate. I threw it off my back foot for whatever reason. I just didn't mean to. Thankfully, Cooper adjusted correctly. And we got the touchdown. So let's go ahead and kick an extra point. Then we'll get on defense for the first time. I'm going to try. It's not new. I've done it several years ago, but I always forget that I have it. I'm going to try some more Tampa 2 defense. Probably not much today since they're going to run the ball so much. Unless that can work well against the run. I don't think it can. Looks like they got a an impact guy on the right. I'm going to kick it slightly over here to the left. Wiltshire, pretty strong kick. At least the impact guy is not going to catch that good tackle there by somebody we're gonna go with just a lot of cover two man just try to keep everything in front of us as, as best we can we're gonna do something like this just watch out for little Felix somebody got to stop I thought that was me uh, let's see I'm just gonna call the same play we need to get them in third and longs all day. That's the plan. We'll do something like this. Good tackle. Came down on first tackle on the first hit. Third and seven. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Let me go back here. Formation subs. The one thing I'm going to do, we haven't talked about this. I am going to have uh, defense. I am going to, yes, I talked about this in the previous video. Okay, I just want to make sure Gibbons is in the is in the slot as our nickel. Just want to make sure of that. Let's go cloud. Down and seven, ball and I'm going to control Thomas for the first time. Uh, no, I actually think I may control Nixon. I may have a better chance on this side. Let's see if we can get to him. Oh, my gosh. You got to be kidding. You gotta be kidding. There he goes, six points. That's what you gotta deal with, impact guys. I mean, they went third and seven, they just ran the ball. We had him right there, bounced right off me. And I tried to save a touchdown as best I could right here, but it didn't matter what happened. He just shrugged me right off. Ah, just that's part of it. So we'll get the ball back, trying to get the touchdown back. I think our defense played just fine there, except they just got a tackle. But when you're going up against an impact halfback, you're going to get that problem. And he hits the PAT. Less than two Unfortunately. We are tied. I'm going to go right back on offense and keep doing what we're doing. We've done a lot of stuff on the right hash. Well, hopefully we get on the left hash a little bit and do some things. Looks like we're right down the middle of the field. I'll probably let that one go. Gun spread. It's on my mind. We're going to go if I can find it. QB choice. Zone dime. I will. Ooh, I guess we're going to keep this. I'm going to get about three or four with Stucky. Not too bad. I am. Let's do speed option. We're going zone nickel. Here, they don't have their impact guy out there, at least. Let's go this way. Just great defense. I had nowhere to go. So it's, what, third and six? Third and seven. Uh, I guess we're going to go... I had another play here. Where's that at? Is it in this formation? There it is. Compost... Uh, let's try. Let's try compost stick. We're going man. May end up going back to Cooper on this one. Cover one. Good throw. Good catch by Cooper. Whew. Great catch. Good job all around, everybody. All right, let's stay in this formation. Let's go P. Reed. Man 4-3. I can't tell who's on who. Uh, okay, I think we're going to run this ball. Just get about eight or nine with Williams. Not a bad play there. 
Second and two. Let's go back to gun spread. I'm going to go wide receiver curls. They're going man, and they're blitzing that nickel. So we're going to go to somebody on the right here. We'll go to Williams, trying to get away from that guy. Get a first down. Good play there. Uh, let's give him a bit of a break again. Let's go back and let's run speed option with Hardesty. We're going zone 4-3. Uh, we're going to go to the right. Get a block out there. Oh, he, ah, dang it. Ah, that stinks. He dove way too early. I probably got to got a touchdown here. I got spooked right there. I should have kept it. Ah, that's okay. We still got a good yardage. Good block by Stucky. I should have juked right here and I didn't. Well, I did. I got out of bounds. Either way, good play. We are on the 32. Let's just stay here and try P roll out again. Ah, they're going back to man, so we may end up going back to Cooper. Let's see. Cover zero. Ah, too far out. That may get picked. It was worth the shot. Uh, third and one. Let's just do a basic slam with Williams. They're going man nickel. Let's see if we can just pick up the first. I'm going to go this way. Yeah, we'll just go back to the right. Just don't let that guy do any damage. Get a first down there. He's still, he's feeling okay. We haven't done anything from this formation. I want to flip this. And I want to try... And we could go back to our normal play that we usually use off this formation, but there's a couple more plays I want to run with this, this formation. The now we got a two decent tight ends. Stucky, back in the gun. Go over here, but I didn't mean to juke, but good job, Batiste. We're it's second and one. Uh, where's that play at that I was talking about? Uh, let's go wide receiver deep post. And they're going man. Uh... This may not work. The green I think I may just run here. Yeah. Just didn't think about that. Let's just get out of bounds. We got a first down with Stucky. I don't, that's not a rollout. That's just me trying to pick up a first down with the quarterback. All right, one second. We're on the nine. Uh, we don't have to get too fancy here. Let's go. How about we go P. Reed. Man nickel. We haven't called this one yet. They're doing... Uh, I think I'm just going to hand this off. Yes, and I think we're going to get a touchdown. Good deal. So we got the touchdown back. And we are going to get an extra point. Just a good read there. I saw they were going man coverage. We just had the good numbers on that side. Let's get back on defense and try to tackle better. Next drive, I want to try some five wide. We haven't got to do enough of that yet. Any of it, I should say. We got a lot of skilled players. You want to get them the ball as much as you can. You just got so many guys, but there's only one ball to go around. We'll do something like this. That's a strong kick. He's going to return it. Morgan fields it in the end zone. Let's see what they do here. Somebody get a tackle. That may be coming back. Probably a clipping. And it is. That's usually what happens when you see a flag there. We will definitely accept that. They are on the 10. Now let's go nickel man. We'll do something like this. Now I got the talented linebacker to go 4-3 without having to go nickel all the time against a three wide set. Oh, good play. Get a first down there. Not a bad play. Uh, we'll go back to 4-3, man. Cover two. Uh, we'll do something like this. Could be a back and forth game unless we can get some stops on defense. There he goes. Get a first down. Good play by the quarterback. That was a triple... Reverse option, I think, if I'm not mistaken. I'll stay in man. They're going gun ace twins. Same formation as we got. 
Intercept that or not. Get a first down. Well, so I would like to play some zone against some of that. Uh, let's do a cover two. Let's try this Tampa two thing. Now, the Tampa two is very simple. You got to control the middle linebacker so you can back up and go this, that, and the other. We're going to try some of that. Now, this may be a bad idea against a basic run play, but we're about to find out. There he goes. There he goes. I told you. I don't know what to do about that. What do you do? He's just going to break tackles left and right. How many need to break? One, two, just awful. Just dreadful. Uh, all right, let's go back on offense and get that touchdown back. As soon as I went with that Tampa two, what happened? Went right down the field and scored. But he broke tackles as well. I, I, you have no answer for that unless your guys just actually tackle. And you can't control every one of them, and it's probably not the best idea anyways. Good old impact halfbacks. I tell you, they're the bane of everybody's existence in this game. All right, let's see if Patisse can do something with this. Let's see if we can get a... Nope, just no, nothing open whatsoever. No blocking. Uh, let's go... Uh, I said I was going to go five wide, so let's do that. Let's do that, and let's start off with slot seam. Going zone nickel. Got a few options here. Good catch by Batiste. Going to pick up eight or nine. Uh, look, we can try zig outs. We're going man. They're blitzing the two inside guys. Does that mean they Please go cover zero. The game never goes cover. Nope, they're going cover one. I knew they was going to go cover one. Never go cover zero when we go five wide. Never. We're going to get the first down. That is the freshman's first catch of the season. Good for him. All right, let's go speed option. Let's get back out of that going to gun spread or going man. Uh, let's just go this direction. Good defense. I, I couldn't really have pitched it. I wouldn't have got much extra yardage that way. Second and seven. I am. I may treat this as a toss. We'll go power option. Zone 4 3. Yeah, I'm going to go to the right. Get a block. Great block right there. By the fullback. Just give that to Williams. Uh, okay, what can we do from here? I want to... Let's go wide stick from gun two back slot. They're going man. Love to go to somebody on the outside. Cover zero. Let's see if Batiste can handle it. Great catch. Six points. All right, so we're scoring at least. We're keeping up with them, they're, but they're keeping up with us <laughs> in a sense. But that was a great throw by far. His best deep ball of the day. The other one, he overshot it. That corner had no chance. Just right on the back shoulder. Let's get the extra point and figure out what to do on defense. I wish I had an answer for it, but you, there is no answer to stopping an impact halfback. You just got to hope you tackle right. I am definitely going to go back to man, that's for sure. I would love to blitz their quarterback, but I can't because they run the ball well. It's just a... It puts you in a bind. For me, at least. We're going to kick this back over to the left. Should be a really strong kick. Good job, Wiltshire. I think he's going to return it, though. He's got the best power of the two, and he still can't get it that far down the field. I'm going to go 4-3, man. All right, Phyllis. Let's try to stop this running back. I keep getting pushed back hard. Pick that off next time. Good tackle by Hollis. I'm going to stay in the same play. We're going too wide. They are doing that, so we're going to do this. Ah, oh, dang it. Somebody stop him. All right, so it's third and four. I may actually go man again. Ah, oh, it's going third and five. Oh. Oh, I'm going to take a chance. We're going to go cloud. Very leery of this. Please pass it. Do not run the ball. If you if you run it, you're smart. 
<laughs> but I'm going to take a chance to say they'll pass. Oh, they went QB draw. Great call. Great call. Was not expecting that. First and 10. So their offensive coordinator is drawing it up pretty well at the moment. Let's see what happens here. That left guard is destroying me. Just too easy. Too easy across the board. Already has 155 yards rushing. He's on pace to get close to 400. <laughs> Which is embarrassing, but hey, it is what it is. Our open field tackle is pretty good when they pass it. Second and six, they call the timeout. I am going to take a chance. We're going to do a zone blitz. We got to throw something a little bit different at him. Hmm. Not a big. Please don't run up the middle. He's got all day to. Good. Gee whiz. They're just playing great. We're just not doing good enough on defense. Just giving up everything. I'm going to go back to man cover two. Like, we just can't do anything right. Let's do something like this. Intercept that. That's a loss of yardage that may call a timeout. No, but, yep, the clock's still going. Please keep passing the ball. I'm going to try another zone blitz. Oh, they're uh, Please throw it. Half fullback dive. Gee whiz, what a play call. Look at this. What's going on? <laughs> They're playing perfect football on offense. It's insane. And I have no answer for it. Uh, I'm going to go all out blitz. I think they're on the verge of scoring anyways. Do something like this, perhaps. Just, well, again, it don't matter. It don't matter what we call. They're just going to get their yards. So it's just back and forth. More defensive ineptitude. Maybe we'll get lucky in the third quarter and they'll turn the ball over. Because I don't know what else to do about it. We got 57 seconds. They get the ball started in the third quarter. I would prefer to get a touchdown here before half, get the lead, before they go back in the third quarter and score again. <laughs> Because, again, I, I don't have an answer. I wish I did, but I don't. Not at the moment. Uh, let's see if Batiz can do something here. Nope. Just nobody. Ah, somebody blocked for me. 54 seconds. We can try to get down the field. I'm going to run a basic option for now, though. We got all three time. I'm just curious to see how this play will do. I had to pitch that quick. Good block there. Go, Williams. Go, Williams. Great play. I think that safety came on the back end and saved the touchdown. It is, we're on the 46, it's 46 seconds. I'm sorry. Let's go. Tight end dig. That linebacker's going to cause us fists today, I'm afraid. He's blitzing. Didn't get out of bounds. We'll probably call a timeout. Second and four. We can do wide receiver curls. Man dime. I like that. We just got to be real quick on this throw unless they go cover zero. But they're not. I have to go over here. Oh, just enough. Just enough. Just get out of bounds. Save a timeout. We are on the 11. Let's keep this very simple. Let's go wide halfback screen. We're going zone. I'm trying to think of ways to get to the outside. This will go back to Williams. They've called zone every time we've called this play. Ah, dang it. I should have. That's just my fault. We're on the six. I'm going to go ahead and just do the same thing. They're going zone again. Ah, dang it, Al. I lost the yardage. That was stupid. Oh, that was terrible. I'm going to go, I'm going to do that as a quick audible. We're going to halfback corner. That was just my fault. My fault big time. Dang it. Can we get a touchdown with Cooper here? They're going cover one. We need that. Oh, they're going cover zero. Good. 
Intercepted. Ooh. <laughs> that was close. Gee whiz, that was close. That was going to be a pick six right there. Look at this corner. I was like, oh, my gosh, that's pick six. But Cooper got in front of it. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's calm down. Let's figure out what to do on defense. It's obvious our offense is doing their job. No promise whatsoever. Oh, but that halfback screen on that hurry up, I, I threw the ball way too late. Oh, that was just my fault. We got past it, though. 15 seconds. Can we survive the next 15 seconds? I'm going to kick it like normal. Should be a strong kick wherever we want it, but not strong enough. He's going to return it. This should milk some clock at least. Now it's 13 seconds. I assume they're going to just run the ball the rest of the way. One more play left. Do something like this. All right, everybody make a good clean tackle. Somebody out there. Going half back. Oh, quarterback with the QB draw or QB uh, choice. And that should be the end of the first half. So we're up a touchdown. That's good. Everything would go super smoothly if we could just figure out what to do on defense. But maybe we could play better in the second half. All right, end of the first half, 28 to 21. Let's look at some stats. 261 to our 331. We're running the ball well. We're throwing the ball well. We're not turning the ball over. Both teams are perfect on third down. Both teams are great on the turnover front. We can go to individual stats. 15 of 18, three touchdowns, no picks for Stucky. Williams is leading in rushing. Uh, Hardesty and Stucky are just doing just enough. But it's the Williams show. I mean, he's our best player. we got to give him the ball. And so far, that's working out. Receiving, Williams is, uh, yeah, Larry, Larry Williams, he's just doing everything for us. That's just kind of the way it's working out. I'm doing these halfback screens where they're calling zone all the time. And when I call the flare route to the halfback, they're going man. It's just kind of working out where he's just touching the ball more than usual. But that's what they're giving us, which is okay. Cooper's got the two touchdowns, though. Uh, touchdowns. Batista's got a touchdown, that deep ball. Defensively, not a whole lot to see here. But Smith is leading in tackles. He's got one tackle for loss. But no sacks and no interception. So let's get back on defense. Cross your fingers. Maybe we can get a stop. Do something like this. Kicks it off. We got everybody in good position. They just, somebody needs to make a tackle. That's just, that's what it comes down to. Don't get ran over by that guy. I'm going to go back to 4-3, man cover two. I feel like I'm about useless playing this defensive tackle. I'm getting pushed around like it's nothing. I may just start hedge block, hedge cut like that. Good tackle there, Smith. Great tackle. Second and 11. I'm going to stay in cover two, man. I tell you what, their quarterback is playing really well. Like, he's just... I'm very impressed so far. Broken tackle. Broken tackle. Six points. I don't, I don't have an answer. I don't have an answer for it. Don't have an answer for it. Just again. Shove. They're in their right spots. They just got to do their job. I guess we'll go back to the same thing. Come on, fellas. Uh, I wish I had an answer for it. Broken tackle, broken tackle. We finally got down. Picks up five. Um, I'm going to go with just call the same thing. Again, our 4-3 man is doing his job. We just got to get people to make a tackle. I'm trying to get them in the best spots I can. Just two, that's just good blocking there. Nothing I could do about that. So, guess what? We're back to goal line. They're going to get a touchdown. Just, that's just what they're going to do today. Just too easy, and it's frustrating. Do something like this. It's first and goal. They got several tries at this. Just give it to your best player. Keep it simple. At least he got down on first contact. 
I am going to go man lock on this one. Let's see if they can punch this one in. Do something like this. I'm going to spread out this time. They'll keep it on the ground again. Just There's a two eight. I just, I, I, again, what do you do? We went goal line and they just shoved us around. Oh, it's so frustrating. I love this game to death, but the impact halfbacks are just a nightmare. Now you see why I'm going to my all the time. I have to, to keep up with them. Do I need to start running clock? I'm going to have to start thinking about it. Thankfully, our offense is playing just as well. Gosh, it'd be 28 to nothing if that guy didn't play like Herschel Walker every down. All right, Patisse is back at it again. They, they're not going to kick it over to Givens. I wish they... There's no blocking. Nobody can block for us today on kickoffs. Let's go... Let's do a speed option with Hardesty. It's just on my mind. They're going zone 4-3. Love to get those tight ends going as well. I didn't mean to pitch it that early. Dang it, Al. That's just my fault. My fault, my fault. Uh, second and 10. Let's go wide stick. They're going man. Let's see who's on who. Cover zero. Let's see if Batiste can handle it again. Ah, swear. Overshot it. Ah, half back corner. We've been do hitting this comeback route all day. Cooper is keeping us alive with it. I'm going to get Amos down on that one. Cover one. Good catch. Cooper is catching everything, throwing his way. Everything. First and 10. I'm going to run basic slam with Williams. Zone nickel. I want to run to the left. Left tackle got pushed. Just don't fumble it. Get some yards there. Second and six. I'm going to go PA boot. We're going zone. Let's see what they call here. Not, not actually, it wasn't the best of throws. Cooper had to come back for it. You see, he comes in right there. But thankfully, he did. Otherwise, gosh, who knows what would have happened there. All right, first and 10. Looks like Williams is feeling it, so let's just go back to him. We'll run a basic option. Do something like get a block right there. Good job. Good job by the safety, though. Oh, wow. Williams is still going. <laughs> Somehow. It's the impact halfback game. That's for sure. We can try. Halfback screen. This is going to go to Hardesty. They keep going zone every time I call this. Ah. I juke too early. Or too late, I should say. Second and eight. I contemplate running those triple option things, but we don't really have to. Let's go RB deep. The going man. I don't know. Let's see what happens. Ooh, risky throw, but we're going to get the touchdown, I think. He had to stop for it. You go back and look at this. It scared me a little bit. Good job by Cooper for adjusting. But he had to come back just a little bit to get it. So it's the Cooper show. Man, he's killing it today. So what are we going to do on defense, fellas? I don't know. <laughs> I don't have an answer. Oh, I, I, um, maybe I may try some of that zone some more. I mean, the man isn't working. We could try zone again. I may try that Tampa 2 stuff. I may try quarters. We'll figure something out. Do something like this. A good kick. Not going to Felix. But he's going to return it. Good tackle. Let's do quarters. I'm just curious. I, I'm just I'm trying anything at this point. We're gonna do an over front. 
Maybe I can be more serviceable as a linebacker instead of a defensive tackle. Had to come all the way over. Easy nine yards. Let's try Tampa 2. It's second down and two to go. Ball on the 28 yard line. We're going a gun ace twins. Going with the shotgun here. Gotta be careful. It's been a long time since I called this play. Against a pass at least. He drops back. Tackling. All right, he came down. It's not a first down. It's what, third and short? Third and one? Oh, gosh, I will go cover two man. Who's going to get the ball here? I have an idea. I think I'm going to do like a cut block on this one or a cut dive or whatever you want to call it. Maybe push back the guard. Oh, I don't think he got it. Ah, oh, first and ten. He dove. I wasn't really, really expecting him to dive there. I'm gonna try a zone blitz. Maybe they'll sneak in a pass on this one. Ball on the 30 yard line. Please go play action. That would be great. Nope. Halfback dive right up the gut. Perfect play call. Perfect play call. Hang it. Their offense coordinator is just running circles around me at the moment. Uh, let's let's go back to that Tampa two. Well, we'll do the over front. I don't know if that's a good thing to do. Going half back direct. At least we got him down on first contact, but he got five yards. I'm gonna stay Tampa two. Oh, that's the end of the third quarter. We're up a touchdown steal, but they're right on the move. Now the rest of the way we're gonna run clock. Now I think it's worth it at this point. But what I'm going to do first, it's on my mind. I'm going to do a zone blitz. We may get lucky, and they do call a pass play. Please go play action. Dang it, he didn't. Fumble it, fumble it, fumble it. First down. Just another first down. Just perfect play call on that. I mean, with just perfect. They go dive every time I call a zone blitz. Do something like this. I'm going to do some Tampa 2 again to see if we... Broken tackle. Broken tackle. 15 yards. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just throwing darts at a dartboard at this point. Not a single stop the entire game. Let's try this again. Easy six, seven yards. I'm going to try another zone blitz. Maybe we'll, I'm going to call one of these correctly. I'm going to call it at the right time. Ah, not against that front, though. Let me try something like this. We'll stay inward. Just good tackle. I got Nixon off the line. But Hollis is hurt. But we got depth at outside linebacker. I'm not worried about that. They're going go. Man, can we stop them here? That would be incredible. We're going to do something like this. They should go to the left if they run it. Another stupid first down. Unbelievable. Just, I've never seen it. Like, it's just incredible. Like, I've gotten drilled before plenty of times by impact halfbacks and just, but their overall game in general is just insane. Get over there. Dang it. I completely wrecked that play. Just another easy gain. It doesn't matter. We'll just go back to cover two man. Uh, I haven't called this formation all day. Intercepted. Nope. That makes it what? Third and two. They're going goal line. Let's try this again. The only... They went fullback dive, which was smart of them. We're going to do this. Play action wide open. Again, just perfect. I've never seen anything like it. Insane. Execution across the board. I have no words for it. I have no answers for it either. 
So guess what? We're going to go back on offense, and we're going to run clock the rest of the way and try to get a touchdown again and then get back on defense and get lucky on something, anything. Oh, man. Let's see what we can do on offense. For Batiste, I'm, I'm going to let, uh, let's give him a shot. Let's try it one more time. Somebody block for him. Just nobody picks up that dude. We can't even get past the 20 on those. Uh, let's go back and run the ball. Hollis is out for the game, but that doesn't help things. And they're shifting that way. I guess we're going to go this way. Perfect defense and a fumble! <laughs> Of course! Of course, you stupid game. Stupid. Garbage, all that's just garbage. My best player fumbles the ball, which makes no sense. Their player plays the greatest game of his life because that's just the way this game works. I swear. Now it look like a fool for replacing Arkansas and they're going to beat us. Stupid. I, I, I don't know what you want me to do at this point. We're just getting unlucky, I, I mean, going forward. Let's see if we can tie it up now. Is Batiste going to do anything on this play? I'm going to say no, because we can't even get past the 20 on these. Again, we, we finally got past the 20, but not much. Oh, my gosh. Let's go wide stick. Going 5-2. Cover one. Good throw. Two minutes of 45 seconds. Let's go halfback angle. We're going man nickel. And he's double teamed. Well, that doesn't help things. Dang it! Dang it! Dang it! My other man beater got stuck. How badly bad luck can you get on the he got stuck on the dude? Messed up the entire rhythm of it. He got the ball away, but it wasn't anywhere near third and four. Nah, he just wanted to avoid the sack. I'm gonna go direct on him. I know people don't like it, but I don't care at this point. I gotta figure out something. Just at least there wasn't a high snap. Just get a first down with Williams. Oh, I don't need to go five wide. Let's go. Let's go back to halfback screen. They're going man, unfortunately. They're doing that. I'm going. I don't want that impact guy on him. No, I don't. No, we're going to bring. We'll leave him over there. Going cover two. High snap. Cooper's going to make his catch. Second and one. Let's go tunnel screen. We're going man. We're going to go to somebody on the right side. We'll go to our tight end. It's all you, right? Great catch. Didn't get the touchdown, but that's okay. Minute 59 to go. We're on the three. Let's go slam. Let's see if we can get this in. I want to hurry this up so we can get the ball back because we can't score on them. Or we can't play defense against them. Touchdown. All right, so he, he broke the all-time record at the school for rushing touchdowns. So here's what I'm hoping for. There's a minute 49 to go. I'm hoping they pass the rest of the way. If they're smart, they'll run the rest of the way, but I think they're going to pass because they're going to be in a two-minute drill to try to win it. So I'm going to go quarters and just see what they do. We may get lucky on a turnover or something. Otherwise, they'll probably score again, and then we'll just have to get the ball back, and I don't know. We'll do something like this. Middle of the field. Oh, somebody tackle him. Just our tackle has been so miserable today. I'm going to try a zone blitz. Please pass the rest of the way. Please. Just don't give it a 35. At least they had an incompletion. That quarterback got it off in time, though. This quarterback's incredible. How he got that off, I don't know. 
I'm going to go quarters at a 4-3. In second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 30-yard line. Number seven is back in the gun. Let's try. Got to get a big stop right here. He drops back. Stepped up. Ah, he terrible ball. spot, but that's okay. Third and eight. Here it is. Third and seven. Let's go cloud. I didn't want to call a timeout because I was kind of... We can call a timeout after this one if needed. Run the ball. What a... you got to be kidding me. What a perfect play call. They ran the ball on third and seven. I don't have it. I, I don't know. It's just like... Nobody does that, but they've done it twice today because that's just the way the game is going. Jeez. Another catch. They're going to win this thing. It, just, it kills me. It drives me nuts. I just I wish I had an answer. I just don't. I've never seen such perfect execution on offense by a CPU before. And I did it the wrong way. They're going to play action. Ah, fumble it. Please fumble it. Oh, of course you're not going to. They're going to call a timeout. Third and five. I mean, do I go man? Do do I should I expect a run play? I don't know. Let's go. I'm gonna go back and let's expect a pass. Pass it. Pass it. Pass it. He's got all day to throw. Oh, he dropped it. Fourth and five. They're gonna go for it. They're gonna punt it. I'm gonna go. Oh gosh, please make this. Work. We're gonna go all out block. They normally, if they fake it, then that's just kudos to them. I won't get mad about it. Yes, we're coming in to protect. Oh my gosh, we got a chance to actually win this thing. Insane. Somebody get to it. It's kind of hard to do it from there. We're going to let that one go. Just nothing you can get out of that. I am going to... Oh, 40, I, I'm actually going to run the ball. I think we can get some chunk yards off a basic option. That's what we're going to try to do. Had to pitch that one off quick. He has some room. Get a first down. Second and inches, not enough. Let's go halfback screen. They're going man. Oh, we're going to go somebody on the left. Cover zero. Get it, Amos. Freshman. 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 Call a timeout. Call a timeout. Freshman. First of 10 on the 27 yard line. Next up, we're going to go P.A. Reed. Oh my gosh, what a game. Oh, they're, they're, and they're spreading out. I'm gonna do really simple here. We're gonna go the Williams. Try to get a first down. First of 10 on the 27. I am. I'm going to go, I'll probably run the rest of the way unless we can get a touchdown. Go over here. And from here, we can try one more. 17, 16, 15. I think I'm just going to call a timeout and we're going to kick the field goal to win it. I don't want to risk a fumble. Anything goofy happening, I don't think it's worth it. So that's what we're going to do. Let's call a timeout. Two seconds to go. I probably should have done that one second. All right, let's end it right here if we can. Are oh, we going to get two seconds off of it? That's the key. I don't know if we're going to be able to. Let's make the kick first. Do something like that. Game over! Oh, gosh. So frustrating. It didn't have to be frustrating if we knew how to stop an impact halfback. But we got past a 45-42. to 42. That was a real humdinger of a game. Oh, my gosh. My head hurts. I could have swore after that fumble we was going to lose. I'm like, all right, that's it. We can't do it no more. But guess what? Our defense got one stop in the game. One stop. And it was late in the fourth quarter. We got the ball back. We went down the field, and we scored a touchdown. Just ridiculous. What a great game that was. I don't want to have another game like that again because just defensively it's just so frustrating. But let's go look at some stats. 436 of their 562. This is the big reason why 
we still play 06 because the CPU offense does a great job in this game. Yes, it helps they had a running back that just kind of done whatever he wanted, but still it keeps the games a lot more interesting at times. 201 yards, they had 375. Our passing game was ridiculous. When you're putting up 200 in rushing and over 300 in passing, you know you're having a good game for sure on offense. Seven of seven on third down. I think the unsung hero, yes, Stucky made good throws. But I'm here to tell you, Cooper, I think he made every single catch thrown his way. But they had a good uh, game as well on third down, six of seven. We had the one big turnover, and we overcame it somehow. I don't know. But let's go and look at the individual stats. 24-49, four touchdowns, no picks for Stucky. He ended up with 15 yards, but it was Williams on the ground. Had to give him the ball a lot. Hey, if they're going to give the ball to their best impact player, we're going to do the same as well. He ended up with a couple touchdowns. Cooper had three touchdowns. He had nine receptions and not a single drop. We actually didn't have one single drop all game. Just really good by our receiving core. You look at Williams. Amos had a huge catch in the fourth. Batiste, when he was able to get his hands on it, was able to do a good job with it. I wanted to get a right, had a big deep ball as well. Just a good job by everybody who caught the ball. Defensively, our middle linebacker, Smith, eight tackles, holding with six. You go to tackles for loss, Smith and Stamper, not a single sack and not a single interception. Just an incredible. One thing I want to do, I'm going to go back here. I want to look at Arkansas. I thought this quarterback right here played lights out. He was incredible. Running the ball, I thought he played good. He was just really uh, efficient in his spots. But it was this kid right here who done everything. And he had nine broken tackles. How many did Williams have? Four. We we somehow overcame it. I just it, it was that first drive is what worried me the most. We done a really good job until that last play in the first drive. And what happened? He broke two tackles, and it was just the rest was history for their offense, honestly. Just insane. But either way, all right, let's get out of here. Incredible game. I hope you enjoyed all that. So I don't know who we got next. I don't we got a bye week. What I will probably do is uh, we're going to, of course, simulate the rest of this week. I'm going to do some recruiting in the bye week. That way you don't miss that. I don't think I'll have to do anything, honestly. But let's go over to here. I'm going to simulate the rest of the week. And like you said, I got a bye week right there. We're going to simulate that. I want to do that at the tail end of this video as opposed to doing it at the beginning. That way we got number 13 on Ohio State coming up. We're heading up to Columbus, Ohio. That should be a crazy game. Let's go and check out the top 25 for the week. We beat Arkansas. Then you got Florida over Florida International. Auburn. Then you got Ohio State. Barely beat Fresno State. Nebraska. Let's see. NC State. Looks like that's an upset over South Carolina. Then Maryland. Looks like Michigan got upset. Then you have Virginia Tech. Purdue got upset. Colorado. Tennessee won. Then you have uh, UCLA. Virginia. Oklahoma. Texas Tech. Then you have Texas A&M, Northwestern, Miami, and Louisville. So let's go to our recruiting. Looks, so, looks like Stucky made the cover of Sports Illustrated this week. I think everybody's in good shape here. I just want to make sure we don't have any negative pitches for these two guys. What about this free safety? Looks like we're in good shape there. We keep moving up for all of these guys, these two as well. The wide receiver, we already had a positive pitch for him. We knew that. So it looks like we're in great shape for all five of those guys. I'm not going to look at Sports Illustrated. There's really no point in it now. We can do that at the beginning of the next video. But I'm going to go ahead and simulate this week. I just wanted to make sure I had to make any adjustments recruiting-wise. So let's go ahead and do this. We'll do that. Simulate this week. We're going to look at the top 25 scores at the end. And then we're going to, looks like, have a top 10 matchup with the Buckeyes. Then we got a bye week after that. And then we're going to head right to the heart of our conference schedule. Take on the Crimson Tide. Then we finally get to play some... SEC games, which should be a whole lot of fun. So let's go to recruiting. Recruiting should not have done well for us because anytime you not you don't play doesn't help. But here are two guys. We are still okay there. As you see, no pause, no up arrow. Here's a down arrow for that Fresno or for the free safety, but we're still okay here. We just didn't play. Uh, and these other two guys looks like we are in great shape for these two. All right, that is good across the board. And I want to check out, while we're here, the top 25 for this week that we, we did not play in. So Auburn, Purdue, Penn State, Vanderbilt, upset Virginia. Then you have Louisville, NC State, Maryland, Georgia Tech. You got LSU, A&M, Florida State. Tennessee got 
I guess that's not an upset. UCLA beat them. Then you have Miami, Oklahoma got upset, Texas Tech, USC got upset. So several upsets in week three. All right, come on back. We will take on the mighty Ohio State Buckeyes. They're eighth in the country. We are fifth in the country. Should be like probably the, uh, the game of the week, I would imagine. They got more talent than we do. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. They run a pro-style offense, 4-3 defense. I can't wait to get into it. Hopefully our defense could play a little bit better than what we saw. Because right now, as you can tell, we are dead last in rushing defense, but number one in passing defense. And that's because Arkansas didn't throw the ball enough for it to count. All right, come on back, and I'll talk to you later.